Beavers are amazing animals who have many adaptations that help them survive in their habitat. In fact, beavers use their adaptations to create their own habitat. As a reminder, an adaptation is something an animal has or does that helps it survive in its habitat. Webbed hind feet are one example of a beaver adaptation. Like many animals who live in the water, beavers have webbed toes on their hind feet. This makes them very strong swimmers. They can hold their breath for 15 minutes and swim as fast as 6 miles per hour. They also have a grooming claw on their toe that is like a comb. Beavers have two types of thick fur. Long, shiny guard hairs shed water and protect the underfur. Underfur is soft and dense and keeps the beaver warm. Beavers have some of the densest fur in the animal kingdom, with 10,000 hairs per square centimeter. The beaver grooms oil through their fur using a split toenail on their hind foot. This adds waterproofing. Here's a close-up of their soft underfur and shiny guard hairs. Beavers use their flat tail like a rudder while they swim. They store fat in their tail and that helps them stay warm in the winter. In summer, they shed extra heat through their tail instead. Beavers slap their tail on the water to warn other beavers of danger. Tails are also a kickstand to help a beaver stand upright while chewing on trees. Beavers do not use their tail to carry mud or pack it down though. Only cartoon beavers do that. A beaver uses its nimble, hand-like front paws to carry branches, mud, and rocks to build their dams and to manipulate twigs while eating. Beavers have flaps in their noses and ears that close while they swim to keep water out. A nictitating membrane is a third clear eyelid that protects their eyes while they swim. This is an example of a nictitating membrane on a bird. Many animals have this third eyelid. Beavers' sharp front teeth are reinforced with iron, which is why they are a rusty color. With every bite, the hard orange enamel on the front of the teeth wears away the softer white dentin on the back of the teeth. This keeps the teeth sharp as they grow continuously. Sharp tools are necessary when cutting down big trees and eating the bark off twigs. Beavers' lips close behind their teeth. This allows a beaver to chew underwater without drowning. Beavers don't have great eyesight, but whiskers on their face prevent them from running into things in their dark lodge. Beavers can hear and smell well, though, which helps them detect danger. Their eyes, ears, and nose are all located at the top of their head so they can use their senses while swimming with most of their body submerged. Behaviors are adaptations too. Beavers construct dams and build lodges. Beavers build dams because they can swim better than they can walk. The pond behind the dam allows beavers to swim as close as possible to the trees they need for construction materials and for food. If the pond isn't big enough, beavers dig canals so that they can swim even closer to the forest. When a pond is deep enough, ice only forms on its surface. This allows beavers to swim under the ice all winter long. They leave their lodge mainly to grab a snack of twigs from their underwater food cache. Beavers build lodges for protection from predators and from cold. The sturdy mud and stick construction of the lodge protects beavers from wolves, their main predator in Wisconsin, especially when it's frozen solid. The entrances to the beaver lodge are underwater, which means that only other aquatic mammals, like muskrats, can get inside. When filled with a family of beavers, a beaver lodge can stay well above freezing all winter long. This helps beavers warm up when they come back inside from grabbing a snack underwater. Many lodges have two rooms. One is for drying off after exiting the water and eating. The other, drier one, is for sleeping and grooming. Beavers keep their lodge clean and do not poop inside. 
This diagram shows a beaver dam, their lodge, and their winter food storage cache, which is a pile of sticks underneath the ice. Next up, you can watch me, Miss Emily, put on the beaver costume to review adaptations. Then you can put together your own beaver costume. Finally, you can watch a video about how beavers benefit other animals and then play bingo.